Hi, I'm Dr. Ron Eaker, author of A Woman's Guide to Hormone Health, a book that looks at both traditional and non-traditional approaches to menopause and ties it together with the thread of biblical wisdom. Over the past 20 years as an OBGYN physician, I've worked with a number of women who have gone through this transition and I've been there for their joys and their frustrations, their excitements and their disappointments, their successes and their failures. And it's through that experience and those relationships that I've developed a program that literally has helped hundreds of women not just survive menopause, but embrace it joyfully, just as God intended it to be. You know, God didn't design women to, to decompose at age 51. Menopause may be the end of reproduction, but it's not the end of production. This book is based on two major pillars and concepts. The first is to be well and, and healthy in this season of life, and really any season of life, it has to be a balance of mind, body, and spirit. And that pervades the entire book. Yeah, it's great to get rid of the hot flashes, but if you forget about the anxiety, the stress, the relationships, the prayer life, your spiritual life, then it's really incomplete. The second major concept is what we call the four A's. Attitude, aptitude, action, and apothecary. And those are four biblically based concepts that serve as a toolbox, as a game plan, as a way to really douse the hot flashes, morph the mood changes, and nix the night sweats. Well, why is this book important? We're seeing the largest influx of women in the history of this nation into the menopausal time frame. Every 55 seconds, a woman turns 50 in this country. Over 50 million women are entering into this perimenopause, menopause time frame. The timing is excellent. And these are women who are not satisfied with the status quo. They're not satisfied to be patronized and just patted on the head and to be told, oh darling, it's just your hormones. These women want answers. They want options. And they want them in the context of their worldview. You've got to remember, these are folks who have literally changed society every decade that they've aged. These women wore flowers in their hair in the 60s, they burned their bras in the 70s, and the 80s they climbed the corporate ladder, and the 90s in this new millennium. They're making women's health care, and menopause in particular, one of the greatest health care issues facing our country today. Why is this book unique? It's unique because it takes both traditional and non-traditional approaches, and it combines those in a, in a way that I've not seen done before. It cuts through all this maze, this mire, this misinformation out there about traditional hormone therapy, and it narrows it down into easily understood, jargon-free information that a woman can use to really help make these decisions for her life. But more importantly, it looks at non-traditional approaches. It looks at things like herbs and vitamins and then nutrition and exercise and prayer, bioidentical hormones, all the things that women are demanding information about today. And it allows them to use those tools, again, in the context of their Christian worldview to make the right kind of decisions. The timing of this book is perfect. Not a day goes by when you can't see information on the internet, on the radio, on the television that's talking about menopause and talking about hormones. Controversy is everywhere and controversy is good because it sells books. You know, every day in the office I get a woman who comes in and says, I just feel out of control. A woman's guide to hormone health gives women back that control. It gives them the choices, it gives them the options so that they can make decisions with their doctor about what's best for them. They intuitively know that MD doesn't stand for menopause director. They know that they can partner with their physician if they have the knowledge to help make the right decisions. A Woman's Guide to Hormone Health is simple, it's practical, it's applicable to literally millions of women who are out there struggling with these issues right now. And it's written in a style that teaches, tickles, and transforms lives. I look forward to working with you on this project.